What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counter Punch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Tyson the Gypsy King Fury, Anthony Joshua. Get this. Fury credits Joshua for retirement return. Wow. The WBC heavyweight champion Tyson Fury has credited Anthony Joshua for sparking his boxing return as the prospect of fighting the British Nigerian excites him. The Gypsy King retired after knocking out Dillian White in April this year. Fury then made a U-turn on the decision and, and held discussions with Joshua to fight on December 3rd. However, the talks, of course, fell through. And <clears throat> this is what he had to say. He said a match with Anthony Joshua would fall into this category. And in September of 2022, I even offered the battle him in the UK for 60-40 split in earnings. I wanted to be I wanted to be a moment in sporting history. I wanted it to be a moment in sporting history and a fight for Britain, but but so far we haven't been able to make it happen. Now I'm due to fight Derek Chisora on December 3rd, having already beat him twice. Okay. Um Fury currently holds the WBC, as we know, and should the pair meet in the ring, then it would make for a never-seen-before fight with all four belts. They're talking about him and Usyk. Meanwhile, Joshua was set to square up against Dillian White early next year. Okay, let me counterpunch. Um, I never really looked at it like that with Tyson Fury, you know, being, you know... Uh, or Joshua motivating Tyson Fury to get back into the ring. And simply because I didn't believe he was leaving anyway. You know, like everybody predicted, if you, if you predict a person, if they become predictable, then how, you know, how serious are you going to take a person that you can predict? See, everybody knew. A lot of people doubted the fact that Tyson Fury retired. We just knew he was taking a little break, maybe to do whatever the hell he wanted to do. You know, so I think, honestly, with Tyson Fury, he's a man just like any other man, regardless if, if he's a, a star or one of the best boxers on the planet. He's a guy that does whatever he wants to do, just like anybody else would do. Okay, not everyone, in it, not everyone else, but anybody else. Okay, so if Tyson wanted to go out and get wasted and party a bit and do this, do that, he could do exactly that. But at no uh, stretch of the imagination did we think Tyson Fury was done. So him saying, oh, I credit Joshua. No, you know, basically what you wanted to do, you wanted to steal the glory from someone that failed to get the glory back. And that was Anthony Joshua. So he wanted that Usyk fight, if not the Usyk fight, a fight with Anthony Joshua himself to make sure he gets the credit for beating the bodybuilder. So I look at that for what it is. Um, Tyson Fury, uh, he's going to do whatever he's going to do. And in whatever he's going to do, it, it always keeps it interesting to me because we always will see Tyson Fury say one thing and then say something contradicting. So it's never a dull moment with him unless you're just tired of people lying back and forth. But then the thing about Tyson, I don't really think that he tries. I think he just feels this way on this day. And then the next day he may feel a totally different way. Bars. So uh, that's what I feel about Tyson Fury. Once again, speaking about Anthony Joshua, you know, you guys tell me what you think. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been counterpunched. Peace.